Hi guys, welcome to another video. Today we are working on an Asus laptop. It has an issue with the display. You can see as, as it's working now, everything is fine. But if we move the screen, you can see everything cuts out. So I'm kind of hoping that it's just a loose display cable. I hope it's not broken or anything. Let's get it open and we'll have a look. Okay, so I've got the screen disconnected um, and I believe the issue is right here. There's a very small kink. And I think there's a break in one of the little cables in there. So the easiest thing to do would just be to replace this cable. They're available online for like 30, 40 bucks. Um, but I'm, what I'm going to try and do um, because the owner of this laptop is a pensioner. I'm going to try and do something a little bit cheaper for them. If I can get into this uh, cable neatly and just see if there's one little wire broken, I can I can fix that a lot cheaper than $30. So I'm going to give that a go. Um, I have to get the bezel off just to give me a little more space to work here. Yeah, let's get going. Okay, so excuse the weird angle here. So I've taken the bezel off to get access, to get more access to where this cable is kinked. I'm hoping that the brake is right in here. So if I can get the covering off and see if I can see the the brake, I may be able to repair it without having to replace that cable and then reinforce it as well. Mm -hmm. Have the part number there. Right, let's try and get into this cable. So we found it, a little green wire broken up, a little, foot, little higher up than where I was. So I was looking down here, and the break was up here, I've just got to find the other end of it. Okay. Okay, so we are under the microscope looking at this cable. What I'm going to try and do is just join it. The cable is so fine and I'm hoping just with the heat of the, um, of the iron, it'll clear away some of the... I'm going to make sure I don't burn these other cables. They're flat. Tell if I've tinned that or not. Oh wow. It looks like that cable was broken in two places. Do you see that? Now that means that the cable
cable's not quite, not gonna line up quite well. Okay, let's see if I can do the top part. So what do we think the chances are of this actually holding? Zero, 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 or zero? Hmm? So let's, let's put some flux there. Work north to south. Try and get kind of lined up. And then let's get some solder on there. Let's see what happens. Have a close look. Let me just wipe this flux up. What do we think? It's the one side. It's not pretty, but will it do the job? Will it do the job? Only one way to find out. Okay, so this is testing the cable. I've connected up, you see it's running. The flickering is just on the camera. The display itself is perfect. So there's, you can't see, anyway, right there the cable is the one that we repaired. So I'm just checking to see if I've missed one. I do think that is the only one. Do you think that that is repaired? I'm not sure how long that's going to last though. I have to come up with a good way of re-insulating this and making it strong so that it can withstand the opening and closing of the, the screen. But yeah, I think that, that was our only little problem, one broken wire. The new cable, like I said, is 30 or $40, so it's not too expensive, but if you can repair something, why not? So let me try and come up with a good way of securing that. And we'll be back. So this is finishing up the Asus laptop. I ended up having to get another cable for the screen, an LBDS cable. Um, I managed to repair the broken cable, but the, the thickness of the cable, once it was repaired, it was too thick to actually fit into the housing here. There's not much space at all where 
It comes from the board up through to the display itself. So I had to go ahead and buy another cable. Um, funny thing is that the first cable I got off Amazon didn't work. So I had to send that back and I had to reorder a second one from a different supplier. The second one, as you can see, is working fine. So the customer should be happy with that. That's it for this video. Thanks again for watching. Please like and subscribe and we'll catch you in the next one. Ciao.